Could I get a moment of you two singing the iconic opening theme song? You know what? They're going to play that at our funeral. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Come and let's play together in the bright sunny weather. Let's all go to Gullah Gullah Island. Lots to see and to do there. All we need now is you there. Let's all go to Gullah Gullah Island. Just take your foot in your hand. That means hurry up. Don't, Don't miss the, the good things that we planned. Plan. So come, come and let's play together in the bright sunny weather. Let's all go to Gullah Gullah Island. Gullah Gullah Island. Gullah Gullah Island. <laughs> Oh, do you guys think we could ever see a Gullah Gullah Island reboot? Do you think a show like Gullah Gullah Island could work today? I think it could work. You know, it would have to be different perhaps, but there are people's children watching it now and they are as fascinated as, as, as their parents had been. It was a bit of a surprise after Gullah Gullah Island ended that more shows like that didn't happen. It was like, well, that... I mean, um, at some point later, we had been in um, sort of meetings with some other networks about doing TV shows, and they were saying, well, you know, kids, they can't follow long storylines like that, uh, songs, they just need ditties. If it's longer than a few seconds, they don't get it. And I'm like, you, you're joking, right? Because <laughs> <laughs> the kids know all the songs, and they know all the songs you don't even want them to know. They know them. And um, they are capable of so much. The things is we've heard from viewers they liked that each show taught youth a lesson that there was a family uh we've got comments from many people as you said they saw us we were their parents or we were their uncles or aunts we were a positive influence in their lives there was music that people could dance to and move to. Why do you think that there's been this enduring love and nostalgia for the show, even to this day? If you ask me, and this is my opinion, it's because we were genuine. We were- That's what I was gonna say. Yeah. <laughs> I was thinking of- Yeah, we, were, we, we, we weren't acting really. We were and we weren't. Um, just a genuine love and care for, for people. And when I first started doing it, you know, we had been, I was, we were storytellers in theater. We traveled and did stories. And the first time they set up that camera, I was like, oh my, I, I, it was terrifying. And so then I said to myself, that camera is a window and I know the kid on the other side. I can talk to that kid on the other side. He lives on my street. When, you know, we were, we were performers and we traveled. And so um, Ron didn't have a nine to five. And so often when we were on the road, Ron was home during the day. And neighborhood kids would come dun, 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 to see if Mr. Ron could come out and play. This was before Gullah Gullah Island. They'd see me out with our older Pushing her on the swing. Pushing Sarah around. And so it was, that's what the producers, the head writer saw when they followed us around. Yeah. And Natalie's always doing crafts. Um, yeah. And that's what they saw. So that's. He really worked for the newspaper. The characters yeah. <laughs> were developed. I was really a crafter and an artist and I still am. So we just got to be ourselves. And the music. Music is a very important part of Gullah Geechee culture. There's music and rhythm in our speech. There's music all about us. <laughs> yeah. We really cared. And I'm also, you know, we were there really our kids. It was really a family. And that comes through. Shifting to you guys. You've been together for almost 40 years. What advice would you guys have for maintaining such a long lasting relationship? The best thing I can say for me is that I really like him. He's my friend and he's my partner. Um, and when we got married, uh, you know, there's people like, we have to have the wedding. We are like, the wedding is not the thing. It's the marriage is that the thing. It's the partnership that's the thing. And we have maintained that. And also it's not for everybody, but we have, um, we've enjoyed working together. We've been singing together for 38 years. That doesn't hurt. <laughs> so, you know, I think mutual respect. And finding things to laugh about. Our children, our adult children now say, well, because they thought that their peers, the, the family of families of their peers would sing in their homes all the time because that's what we do. But, you know, <laughs> 
just enjoying each other yeah. in whatever you know yeah because we, we really do way. sing we really do sing all the time in our house and we did it before Gullah Gullah Island and we still do it and we make up some yeah and everybody in the house I mean Simeon Sarah Ron and I all the whole family we are known to burst into song at any given time sometimes inappropriate don't let there be good music in the supermarket. I'd be like, baby, please stop singing out loud. <laughs> so you know. I would be dancing, not necessarily singing out loud. Yeah, okay. Dancing <laughs> in the Walmart. All right. <laughs>